it's time. This is all that's left. Go home? Yes. There she is. Still waiting. Remember our promise. Elster. Hello, Ariane. I can't do it. You have to do it. It's time for this to end. Please. <sighs> yep, I figured this was gonna happen. We have to kill her. I'm sorry. time. I think that was the promise. <sighs> and that's all it took. that needed to be done. How many repetitions did this take? Holy crap. Hey guys, this is uh, Future Me here. So uh, I did some research on how to get all the endings to Signalis, and it turns out there are... Uh, Five endings, in a sense. Two of which we've already seen in this uh, playthrough of mine. The promise ending, which I had just shown you. And uh, the fake ending, which uh, is the one that almost fooled me. Uh, where, you know, Elster doesn't make it into the Penrose 512 and sustains critical damage, losing an arm and such. We've already seen that one as well. Um, yeah, so that is uh two of the five endings now the other endings requires me to play very very well in order to achieve so i had to struggle to get one of the endings and uh i'm going to show that ending right now the ending uh, i'm talking about is the leave ending in order to get the leave ending you have to basically uh, you, you can't be, it has some, it has something to do with your health bar. You have to always be at like, uh, at top health. And if you take damage, you need to heal immediately with like a repair patch or, uh, a repair spray, depending on how much damage you take. Cause, uh, yeah, I don't know if overhealing is a thing, but cause I saw a stat for that at the end of the game. So, uh, you know, just keep that in mind. Try not to overheal, but you know, just try heal just right. Yeah, it was weird. Another requirement for this ending is I had to dawdle a lot and, you know, interact with, like, uh, defective doors and NPCs, like, a lot of times. So I interacted with literally every defective door at least 40 times and every NPC, like, 35 times. It was, it was tedious. So, uh, 
yeah, just appreciate the amount of work I put into getting this ending, because this was by far the most annoying ending to get for me. Alright, so I AFK'd here in this beach flashback, right? And I went to go get a snack, and then I found myself not in the beach anymore. So I, so I don't know what happened uh, to try and get this ending. I'm going for the leave ending, which I assume is the bad ending. So, uh... You know, uh, I'm pretty sure I've already explained how to, how I'm supposed to go about getting that. Uh, but yeah, I'm just going to sit here and see how it kicked me out the, the first time. I think I was like right up against the water. So I'm going to do that again. Because I need to sit here, because I need to sit here for about five minutes. So I wonder how it kicks me out. Oh! Hmm? That's interesting. Okay, there's that timer again. Just make sure that this uh, doesn't, doesn't play out any differently. This is the fake ending. Which, you know, I was almost fooled by this as well. This is where Elstrick dies. So far, this is all just the same. Yeah, and the life will fade, and that's the end. Alright. I may have to delete this recording after all. Hmm. <laughs> yep, okay, sweet. Can I skip this slant? Sealed envelopes among the, it says classified only gets on it's unopened. Not I'm not allowed to open this envelope. It probably contains classified information about me. Okay, so last time I didn't open this. But you know, in an effort to actually keep this six minute recording, if I'm gonna delete the last five minutes, I might as well open this just to see what was actually in it. Elster. Replica known issues, Penrose program. Guest all officers on only. 
Previous experience with this replica model have given us insight into irregularities in their behavior that stem from the original neural pattern used for this unit. Due to sensitive nature of this information, it should be destroyed after read. Elster. Elster units were chosen for the Penrose program for the adapt building reliability under long-term isolation conditions. Stoic and reserved Elster units have a relatively stable neural pattern. It is best for you to leave it alone and interact with Elster unit as little as possible. What? Oh yeah, yeah. Okay, so the uh, so the neural pattern's really good, um, but you know, just interact with this uh, one as least as possible, just so you don't you know fuck it up. You know, we worked hard on this one, and we don't want your grubby mitts all over it. What the, what is that logic? Ulster's neural pattern was a soldier of Venetian origin, so their needs are basic. Avoid talking to the Elster unit about the war. So I was a soldier. Okay. Penrose vessels are fitted to stabilize the calibration pod, which may help with persona stabilization. To avoid resurfacing Gestalt memories, do not show or give Elster unit photographs, especially of soldiers during the war. Do not show Elster Unit movies or let it listen to music. Do not try to befriend the Elster Unit. You know, considering how these very same people who wrote this note kind of fucked over Elsina Young, I kind of just want to burn this note. Because there is nothing wrong with their friendship. In fact, this is like the most beautiful part of this game. Wow, okay, so... Jesus, they really don't want these, like, replicas to... have their neural pattern, like, altered, or... persona degradation, as they called it. They really don't want that. Although, I don't really see any harm in it. It makes them... lifelike. At least most of the time. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I'm, I got no evidence to suggest that. I don't really know what the difference uh, is from a Elster, from a replica unit with a stable persona, the uh, persona, and a replica unit with uh, with persona degradation. The way I see it, the persona degradation just makes them more human. Which, you know, I kind of like that. Like, the Elster unit actually has compassion. And I think that's just what makes the Elster unit beautiful. Okay, Ariana's notes. Yeah, she's drawing. Yeah, obviously Ariana Young uh, didn't... Well, I don't think she even read that note, but nor would she even listen, because that's exactly the first thing we did together. Like, dance, listen to music, watch movies together. Hell, I even saw, like, photos of the war. Like, I saw, like... Actually, I don't know if I've seen the photo yet. Uh, but I do, I think, in the next chapter. That's... Ugh... Alright, I'm distracting from the ending, so, uh, you know, uh, I don't think anything else is happening. Unless, uh, Ariana com comments on the, uh, me opening a letter. So, if there's nothing. See, they, they dance like they've done this before. Like, there's no shyness or anything behind that. This has happened before. Like, I think Ariane knew and just didn't care. Which, good on her, because she shouldn't have cared. There is absolutely nothing wrong here. The thing that's wrong with their relationship is the people they work for.
because they basically just sent them to die on like a suicide mission. So, I believe this is where the ending's different then. Okay. Please, game. I worked hard on this. Don't make me do this again. It's time. This is all that's left. Go home. <sighs> oh, this is different. In the end, I had to leave it all behind. Whoa, okay. I didn't get to read all that. That was pretty fast. Okay, so I just leave. The, as in the leave ending, right? This is, the, this is it. End. Oh, I just realized she has like stubs for feet. I thought that was just an art design. Ah, huh, okay. So that's just, uh, I, I guess, you know, like, in the terms of robotics terms, actually, nobody cares. Fuck, I just, okay, so that was, that was the ending. <sighs> wow. So that was the bad ending, huh? Yeah, I can't agree. That is a bad ending. Like, there was really nothing interesting about it. I just leave. <sighs> there it is. Leave. Oh my god. Death cheated. Zero. I wonder what that means, because it's it should be the same as my death counter, right? I don't see how death cheated and times died should change at all times, because like they should always be the same, otherwise you wouldn't have a game. Alright, so uh, moving on, the next ending we will be going for is the memory ending. Now in this ending I basically have to speedrun the game. Uh, I can't dawdle too much. I have to beat the game within a certain time limit. Uh, and I basically have to avoid damage, avoid combat. Uh, I can't stay at full health uh, too much, like in the leave ending. So I am allowed to be a little lenient with the health. So I'm not allowed to heal immediately once I take damage. Or, you know, I could probably stay in the yellow health for, you know, a bit of time. Um, but I can't, you know, stay there for a prolonged period of time. So it's it's a little lenient with the health. But I feel like the main thing, the main constraint here is I have to I have to beat this game fast. I just had to move. I can't. I had to avoid talking to NPCs. I'm not allowed to talk to NPCs. So I just rushed past everything. So yeah, uh, the memory ending, or as I like to call it, the speed run ending. I'm skipping all the lore and stuff because I'm pretty sure it's all it, that this is all the same. Yeah, it's just telling us like, you know, what actually happened. Uh, but I do want to see if this is different. I had to end this way. Okay. So from the moment I enter through this last door, this is where the ending's different. This should be the memory ending. This is all that's left. Okay. Please tell me this isn't the promise ending. come back for you. It's me. 
I'll start. Alster? Oh. Oh. I'm sorry, but I don't remember. It's okay. Is this another bad ending? Perhaps this is hell. Please. Just let me stay by your side. A little longer. Okay, out of all the endings I've seen so far, I prefer the promise ending. I recognize that. Memory! Look at those stats! Total game time, 4 hours. Total active play time, 3 hours, 48 minutes. Whew. Yep. Enemies killed, 53. Damn. Okay. Well... That's it. All right, and now on to the final ending to Signalis. Now, the final ending is, of course, the secret ending, but is also uh, supposedly the true ending to Signalis. I think I don't really know. I don't. I can, can you really call it a true ending? I I don't know. It. I think you know what. Whatever it. Is, whatever the case. This is the secret ending. All right. Um. Now, I found this ending to be quite weird, so you will probably get the same opinion after you see it. Um, but the requirements to get this ending were, of course, weird, as the, usually the case with uh, all secret endings. I don't know what I was expecting with this, uh, considering this game had took some inspirations from silent hill and resident evil i imagine this was going to be a joke ending i imagine this is going to be like you know a ufo ending or a dog ending of some sort you know where we find out a dog has been programming the whole game or something you know um but uh no uh I'd, at least i don't think this is the case so uh yeah in order to get this ending i needed to open this box this box right here that's in the what I assume be Ariane's room on what Rotfront Lang I I I, forget. I think it was Rotfront uh you know it's just this this is there like Ariane's Ariane's room I think uh but yeah the point is we need to open this box now of course you can see that this is a lockbox safe with three deadbolt locks on it so I need to find three keys. And then I need to find the locker combination to open this box. And opening this box is the key to this ending, which uh, I believe I haven't named. I haven't uh, actually said what the name, the ending uh, actually was called. So uh, yeah, uh, this is the Lily ending. So uh, I'm going to show you how to get that. With a frequency 96 inside the room with the four cages, inspect the bottom right cage. What? Yeah, better. I just had to exit and le uh, exit and re-enter the room. There it is. Yeah, better. Oh my god. Well, wait. How was Boo. how are people supposed to figure that out? Boo, why things go well for you? Boo. Boo. What? Boo. Okay, well that's one key down, two to go. So I'm just gonna turn this on. What does this sound like?
This sounds like white noise. What is the point of this? I don't, I don't, I don't get it. What is, what is the point? I thought this was gonna be uh, like a signal or something that I'm supposed to reach. One of these, one of these days, it's gonna, there's some, some, like demented, it's gonna appear on the radio. Okay. Uh up. Oh, that's what I'm looking for. All right. Sweet. Mission accomplished. All right. This may be a little uh, little cut off point from you know me getting all the endings, but you know this is on the this is still me trying to get the secret ending. So, and the first time you end up in the beach, you get you can go to the left to get a bunch of cryptic net messages like that. I'm going to go to the right because apparently yeah, due to the low res, I didn't see these. For there be like sorts of death somewhere in the body rem some it banish death quite away with the spirit. Don't know what that means. One kind of death, uh, on one kind of death, the spirit also died. While yet the body was in vigor for many years, sometimes it dieth with the body, but is raised up again where the body did decay. More gibberish. And a star fell in the sky and a mountain into the, uh, the sea and turned to blood, moon dark, turned dark. calls to me in a sea of flesh we will become one but I can never go back to being me interesting I don't think I read that before unless I'm mistaken but yeah those are the notes um, unless something different happens here which I doubt so I'm here to continue off again the third key for the lily ending so I need a radio frequency of 240 Hertz when going into the back rooms on rot front is this the back room yes it is okay so I'm looking for a pile of boxes and there's some white books this looks like it it's right there apparently Alright, I got the key of sacrifice. Um, so I found some interesting things on the sacrifice, uh, the on these keys. Right, there's little logs in them. So the first one I picked up is the key of love. Cycle 888. I've tried to teach Elster how to dance. It's so cute how clumsy she can be when it comes to these things. Well, you know, she wasn't programmed to actually be able to dance. But then again, she is program for combat so I imagine you know it shouldn't be too difficult actually you know if you're able to stand on two little stubby feet then yeah honestly uh, I guess this is just a human nature sort of thing this is just another more on the human side rather than a hardware design choice anyway uh, that is the key of love key of eternity I got uh, in Serpinski uh, I got into Serpinski uh, facility uh, right in the storch uh, bedroom. Are you still looking for answers where there are only questions? Yep, and it has like the high mat symbol on it. This is another planetary symbol. I think this is rot front. I don't remember. Actually, I don't know. I forget which one that one is. No, that one's rot front. The key of sacrifice. Uh, on the horizon, I saw a star fall into the sea and the sound of thunder like trumpets of angels flew over the water you see that sounds like similar imagery we've seen before in this game so there's some cryptic shenanigans going on these okay now Let's see what we got. The key of eternity. Key 
Key of Love. Key of Sacrifice. Okay. Now we have a new problem. This safe. How in God's name are we going to open this? There's got to be something, some hint. I actually do not know the answer to this. I didn't read that far in the guide. First of all, two ideas, two ideas. I'm gonna see if I can figure this out by myself. We have moon sun scales, rook tree sword. Um, I don't think any of these count as that symbol. The national flag, it's meaningless. This. No, 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 not that. No, I don't want that. I want. There we go. Ariana's old radio transmitter. It's still transmitting. 14195. This is my idea. It's gotta be hidden right here, right? The code. So, I tried everything, everything I thought of. I couldn't find like a birthday, I tried every radio signal, their signal, uh, none of them would give me a transcription, uh, meaning I can't really get a uh, code for this. So I'm gonna turn that off. Um, however, I did try to look it up, because I gave up. Um, I did try to look up the code. And, uh, this code might be, Oof. this might be a problem for me to remember, uh, hold up, let me, let, let me, let me get a notepad. Four eight six six. Actually, wait. What am I doing? I just copy and paste the code. What am I doing? Why am I? Why am I doing this? Okay. Okay. So, I'm back. I tried every single radio frequency. I couldn't get a, like a transcription service on it, so there's nothing I could really do on that. I looked through all my, literally every memory here, I could not find anything that looked like a potential code that actually worked on the safe. Um, nothing that I could find anyway. Uh, maybe someone else would have a better luck. So I got to the point where I started to look it up to figure out uh, what the code actually is. And uh, nobody seems to know what the code is for the safe. Nobody at all. However, uh, there is some, there is one number, right? That's excessively long that I wrote down. And I want to try that. Okay, so the code is three, nine, four, Eight six six zero one 
3260. 1064. What? That works! Huh? White lilies. Oh! Huh! So that's why this game is called the Lily Ending. What is this D-pad symbol on the, uh... On the vase. Oh, it's green. Yeah, I'll pick up the flower. What? What's going on? Future me trans like that. Oh, it's the eye. Oh. Okay. This was worth all the trouble. Oh, that's it. Okay. Felt a little awkward, uh, but... I'm not gonna lie, that was something. The guy told me just beat the game after unlocking all those locks, but uh, some of the ending guides did not have that code I just put in. I had to, look, I had to search at a discrete location. Oh my. Was that it? There's no music here. There's there's nothing. How funny would it be if this the credits ended and I realized there's more game? That weird artifact, that like chromatic artifact in the center implied a lot of like things like i don't know what that is something something's off I feel like there's more to this i don't understand let me let, let me think on this for a moment i guess and I'll see what I can, what conclusion I can draw from this. I, I wish there was music for this. Um, wow, um, really quiet. Uh, future me, uh, we'll probably have done something about that, right? Future me! Uh, I think. Ending artifact. That wasn't the title of the ending I thought I was getting. What? Okay. That was, uh, a little weird. I'm gonna do a little bit more research to see if that was it, if, th if that's all there is. Uh, hmm.